Hey everyone, good morning. Happy Masters Week to you. I hope you're getting ready for one of the best weeks in golf. It's Masters Week. I'm out here at Chambersburg Zone, Amen Corner, with our version of Ray's Creek, the Kanaka Jig behind us. New tees are coming in great. I appreciate your support and just taking a look at them, but staying off. We'll still be off through the duration of April, probably into a little bit of May before we get an update on when we can get back on them. The team is actively working to get these things in great shape, including the surrounds but please continue your patience. What else is happening at the clubs this week? Great to have the leagues back. We've had a successful start to the evening leagues and the ladies leagues this week, so wonderful for that. Friday night couples is still scheduled for tomorrow evening. Hopefully the rain moves out of here and uh, we can get on the golf course for Friday night. And then Saturday, we'll be see the return of the juniors to the golf course with our first Op 36 event in the afternoon from two to four. I want you to remember when all these leagues are happening, there's always nine holes open somewhere. So either the front or the back nine, you can still play. So if you see a league, there's somewhere where you can still play. Don't be discouraged. Come out and play. Okay, on the clubhouse side, Chef Corey has whipped up some Augusta-themed special this week. Some egg salad, some ham salad, some burnt mac and cheese, and a little peach ice cream on top of pound cake to get you in the Georgia atmosphere this week. We also have daddy-daughter dance that's happening on Saturday. Ah, boy, I think record participation. Nearly 100 folks are in attendance with a great DJ on site to make it a wonderful evening for families. That's daughter da da Dottie Daughter Dance coming up this week. That's ahead of the Mother's Day brunch. It's about a month away. Start thinking about where you're going to entertain your family for Mother's Day. Details and the link should be posted very soon. That's a Mother's Day brunch coming up shortly. Okay, what else is on my list? New tees. Hopefully you've seen the ability to post your scores for handicap purposes. So there's a rear set of tees where all the, let's call it the gentleman color. So black, blue, white, gold are located for the next handful of weeks and then there's a forward set where the red and green are located we've done this so that we can can have these competitions so it can be playable and postable until we get there speaking of those competition the season long events these are individual match plays or team match plays some with handicap some without I encourage you to check out the details online those all close april 30th so if you are not on the list maybe you didn't play last year maybe you're a new member to the club there are great events to get into that's the match play. Sign up by the end of the month. Member guests, the big three-day that happens June 20th, 21st, 22nd, is now open. Expect a wonderful field for that. If you're thinking about playing, get on the list early. Sign up for the three-day men's member guest. Okay, other happenings. Pickleball. All four courts are back open. We expect to have the windscreens on shortly. And as weather starts to turn, we think it's going to continue to get warmer and warmer. Those courts are now open for play. Remember, don't need a reservation. First come, first serve on the pickleball and the tennis courts. And then swim. It is not too early to get on Mark's list. This is Learn to Swim program is now enrolling for the summer semester or summer start. Click on the website, click on the swimming tab, and you can find details on how to register. Okay, help. let me look at my list again. I think that's all I have. Enjoy it. Come out and play our version of A-Man Corner back here between 12 and 15. And have a great week. Thanks for watching.